opportunity to uh, get away during the cold and finish out my senior year with some of my good friends doing a mission trip. I wasn't really expecting the hard work that we were about to do. I was more expecting uh, hanging out with kids and playing soccer all day, but we also did a lot of labor and hard work. Uh, going to Jamaica, my expectations were um, that, you know, I get a week off of school and then I maybe get to hang out in Jamaica for a week, but once I got there, I realized that uh, I was going to be immersed into a culture that was amazing and be surrounded by a bunch of kids that I realized would change my life forever. Everywhere we went in Jamaica, we were welcomed with open arms and smiles. Uh, the kids were really happy that we brought them new sports equipment and painted game tables out there, uh, outdoor lunch area. But what they were most happy about was our presence and just being there with them to play sports and laugh. Along with the amazing memories that I made while in Jamaica, one thing that I take away is to not take things for granted like a simple glass of water or a fresh t-shirt because for some people in the world that's just not an option. My biggest takeaway from Jamaica I would say is uh, that I take a lot of things for, for granted and that uh, my life here in the U.S. is very different from what a lot of people go through and it was really cool to see. For anyone that's hesitant or wondering if this trip would be good for them, I would just encourage them to go and try it out. It's one week of our lives that we can put our phone down or get away from our house or cars. And it's a way to get out in the world, hang out with some of your friends, brothers, and meet new people and try new things. I can promise you'll never forget the smile that you put on the people's and kids' faces when you just arrive each day to hang out and help them.